ever wondered about the strides India is making in its defense capabilities? The nation is surging ahead, carving a niche for itself in the global defense sector. A shining example of this progress is the VLSR SAM, the vertically launched short range surface to air missile, a product of India's homegrown defense research organization, the DRDO. This missile, tailored for the Indian Navy, is a symbol of the country's self-reliance and technological prowess. Intriguingly, it's derived from the Astra Mark I, an air-to-air -air missile that has already made its mark. This development underlines India's ability to adapt and innovate in the evolving defense landscape. But what makes the VL Sarsam stand out? How has it been designed to meet the Indian Navy's unique requirements? Stay tuned as we delve deeper into the development of the VL Sarsam. The VL Sarsam is no ordinary defense equipment. It's a product of meticulous development. This marvel of modern engineering was brought to life by the Defense Research and Development Organization, or DRDO, specifically for the Indian Navy. The VL Sarsam, or Vertically Launched Short Range Surface to Air Missile, is derived from the well-regarded Astra Mark I air-to-air -air missile. But what makes this missile so special? For starters, it boasts smokeless propulsion, reducing its visibility to adversaries and making it an ideal weapon for stealth operations. It's also equipped with electronic countermeasures, making it capable of outsmarting enemy defenses. And then there's the thrust vector control system, a cutting-edge technology that improves the missile's agility and precision. Let's talk numbers. The VL Sarsam measures approximately 3.931 meters in length and has a diameter of 178 millimeters. It weighs in at a hefty 170 kilograms. These specifications, though impressive, only tell part of the story. The missile's range has been a subject of debate. Initial reports suggested a range of 50 kilometers, but the Ministry of Defense claims a whopping 80 kilometers. This discrepancy has raised eyebrows, especially considering the Astromark 1 origins of the VL Sarsam, which has a maximum range of 110 kilometers. But the VL Sarsam isn't just about brute force, it's also about brains. The missile is integrated with an active high end radio frequency seeker, enabling it to track and engage targets with remarkable accuracy. What's more, it features a data link system for mid course updates and telemetry data transmission further enhancing its targeting capabilities. But the VLSR SAM's journey didn't stop at its creation. It went through rigorous testing. The missile's development included trials from the INS Rana destroyer, suggesting that this missile isn't just a prototype. It's a fully-fledged weapon, ready to defend the skies. A missile's true power is tested in its performance. Unveiling the VLSR SAM's capabilities, the Defense Research and Development Organization, or DRDO, has conducted extensive developmental trials. These trials have been thorough, even including tests from the INS Runner Destroyer, a testament to the missile's adaptability. As we look at these trials, we note the advanced stage of development of the VL SAR SAM. Its successful tests, combined with its impressive features, clearly indicate that the VL SAR SAM is more than ready to take on the skies. The VL Sarsam's successful trials mark a significant milestone in India's defense capabilities. So what have we learned about the VL Sarsam? We've followed its journey from the drawing board to the testing grounds. We've highlighted its unique features like smokeless propulsion and electronic countermeasures and its thrust vector control system. We've delved into its sturdy specifications, a length of 3.931 meters, a diameter of 178 millimeters, and a weight of 170 kilograms. We've also explored its range, a contentious point that adds intrigue to its story. The VL Sarsam is a testament to India's growing defense prowess, a symbol of strength and innovation. 